Jose. Hello, Jose. How's everything today? What's good, man? You're still muted if you're talking. Sorry. There you go. Yeah, I can hear you now. What's up, man? Yeah. Everything good? Yes. Everything. Everything Great. is good. What happened to the rest? How was work? Um, easy. Easy? What do you do? Yes. What do you do for a living? Uh, what? what? What is it that you do for a living? Do for a living is like, que, que ses, you know, like, how do you survive? How, how do you, what do you do in your ah, life? Ah, es como, uh, where do you work? Oh. Yeah, like, yeah, what do you do for a living is like, de que trabajas, you know, like, what do you do, que ses en la vida? Uh -huh. uh, I am a technician, tec technician. In, You're what technician, I'm sorry? In Informatic technician. Oh, you're you're a, you're, a, you're, a com, you're a computer technician. Computer technician, electronic technician. Hey, that's great, man. That's great. Uh -huh. So, do you know how to program? Mm, no, no program. No, uh, no programming networks. No. Yeah. Networks. Network. Oh, okay, that's nice. So you know about uh -huh. CCNA? No, no. Oh. Uh, right. uh, my job is, is uh, uh, I work in at the cell. It's, oh, okay. it's like it's like a cell. All right, I uh, got you. Uh -huh. Oh, that's nice, man. That's nice. That, that's very interesting, actually. You know, like the technology area is. For me, you know, it's, it's, it's actually very interesting, you know, very cool. Um, yeah. Stephanie, how are you, Stephanie? How was your day today? Good evening. I was a good day. All right, great, great. You know, these last days, you've been telling me that you have been really tired, right? Yes. You've been pretty busy. So today was a good day, though? Yes, it's, it's Thursday. It's, yeah, it's Thursday. Yeah, you're right about that. What about you, Catherine? How are you? How was your day today? Good evening. It was a good day. <laughs> All right. What do you do? Uh, how, how, how old are you, Catherine? Hold on. How old are you? Twenty-three years old. Oh my God. Okay. All right. Thank. I thought I asked you because I was going to ask you. Hey, what do you do for a living? You know, well, what do you do for a living, guys? Is like the que trabajas, right? But then you look very young. You know, you look like you're you are. 15 or 14, you know, <laughs> so the 15 to the 14 sounds like, you know, maybe, you know, she's not, <laughs> she's not an adult yet, right? Uh, but yeah, I'm sorry, Catherine, you were saying? Don't worry. So, so you were saying, I'm sorry, I was asking you, like, what, what do you do? Uh, only student, uh, my defense of thesis. Oh, you have your thesis. Yes. Nice, nice. What, 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 uh, what career? Uh, path did, you, did, you, did you get relations and business, <laughs> relations and negocios internacionales. Nice. Okay. All right. So international and and and, and business, international and uh, international affairs, business administration. Yeah, two careers in one. <laughs> where, where? <laughs> that's crazy. That's that's very cool, right? Very good. Yeah. All right, Laura, how was your day, Laura? All right, I know that you're saying fine, but you're muted. Oh, there you go. Yeah, 
Great. I'm fine. It was fine. It was fine. Okay, very good. Awesome. Nancy, hello, Nancy. How was your day today? I am good. I very work. Okay, you worked a lot today? Okay. Yes. All right, nice. Welcome. Nice to see you. Uh, Jacqueline Ramirez, how was your day today? Oh, I think your microphone is not working, Jacqueline. Creo que su micrófono no está funcionando. Right. Can you hear hey. me now? Yes, yes, Jacqueline. Hello, how are you? How was your day today? Uh, it was a little bit tired, but it was good. All right, I'm glad to hear that. Okay, so guys, let's get started. So yesterday, guys, now, guys, I really need you to grab your notebooks and grab a pen because this topic, guys, you're going to get lost if you're not paying attention, uh, if you're not paying your 100%, you know, of attention, okay? All right, yesterday, we were comparing adjectives, remember? Do you remember that we were comparing adjectives, okay? Today, we're going to compare nouns. First of all, guys, let's recap a little bit, okay? So, guys, remember, yesterday we were comparing adjectives, right? So, today we're going to talk about comparing nouns, right? So, so yesterday, guys, think about yesterday. Uh, give me an example, guys, of uh, comparing adjectives from yesterday. By the way, guys, did you finish the exercise? I, I told you that we were going to uh, check the exercise today, right? Did you finish the exercise, guys? Guys. I forget. Yes. Let's, let's finish I'm it sorry, right I now. I forget. Okay? All right. Okay. I mean, it's okay. I mean, guys, it's for your own good, right? For your own learning, mm -hmm. right? Uh, cuando, cuando sus hijos le sean, no le hagan caso, right? Yo le voy a recordar, ¿eh? Tampoco hacía la tarea, le voy a decir. Ajá. All right, so guys. All right, so Sandy, guys. Sandy is what? Uh, I'm going to ask everyone, guys. Catherine, number one. Sandy is what? Okay, Kathy? What's the answer for number one? Oh, I think Kathy missed, uh, lost the connection. All right, Laura, what is the answer for number one, Laura? Thinner. Thinner, very good. Mm -hmm. All right, uh, Jose Fernando, what's the answer for number one, two? Uh, French is more difficult. Difficult? Difficult. Than English. Difficult. 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 Very good, okay. Uh, Nancy, number three. La Roca is the stronger actor in the Hollywood. La Roca is the strongest, okay, the strongest, strongest. stuff, All right, so that is the strongest, All right, very good, uh, Harry Potter, Jacqueline, what's the answer for number four? Yes, Jacqueline? Yes, the Harry Potter books are more interesting than the Jungle Book. Okay, are very good. Okay, more interesting than the Jungle Book. Very good. Uh, my friend is. Dollars. My friend is taller. Very good. Okay, so that is taller. Uh, let's see, Stephanie, Lara. All right, Stephanie, what is the answer for number six? Uh, the whale is most bigger. Most big is it's the most bigger. Big. Mm. Guys, short adjectives, adjetivos que son cortos, what do we oh, do? Bigger. 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 Uh -huh. All right, number seven. Uh, uh, let's see. Nancy, give me number seven, please. Emilia is? Emilia is the is clever? No, uh -uh. no it's clever. Amelia. Clever. Clever. Repeat, guys. Clever. 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 Okay, very good. Clever. Student. And the class. Is, is, uh, is uh, similar intelligent? Yes. Yes. It's similar. Yes. Mm -hmm. 
Very good. Uh, Catherine, all right, Catherine, what is number eight? Uh, Phineas and Fur are, are, are funny. funny. Mm -mm. Comparing two adjectives, guys. <clears throat> Es que si le puse, are the, es que le puse the most funny, the most funny. No. 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 Why are you saying the most, guys? It's the, it's the first, first of all, first, adjective. first of all, first of all, guys, okay. Is it a short or a long adjective? It's short. Short, okay. Short. Secondly, how many things are we comparing? Yes. He is... Right. Guys, how many mm. things are we comparing? I think two. Two because people. Phineas, because Phineas and Park is one show and Garfield is another show. Yes. Thank you, Laura. Thank you. Applause for Laura, guys. Good job, Laura. We are comparing two things. Uh, when we compare two things, Catherine, what do we use? Uh, Funnier. Funnier, very good. Funnier, very good. Good job, Catherine. Applause for Catherine. Good job, Catherine. Hey, applause, guys. Come on. <laughs> All right, very good. All right, uh, Margarita. Margarita is. Uh, let's go, Stephanie. Is the most intelligent student in the school. The most intelligent. Okay. Very good. See, because now you're comparing it to everybody. Okay. Love is Fernando. What is love for you, sir? What is love? Love is love is more important uh, than money. Very good. Really? I'm kidding. It's more important yeah. than money, right? <laughs> Very good. Uh, okay. So next one. Um, oh my God, we don't have any Nancy, right? Let the last one. The last one. Oh, Me ha tapado, no veo. Oh, oh, it says John is in John the. Is, mm, and no then it's a generous, generous. Okay. John is. Oh, oh, yes. ah. Of all the people, it says John yeah, is. The most. The most. The most. The most, right? The most, okay. the most generous. Okay, of all people. Good job, guys. Good job. Okay. Well done. All right. Super, nice. super. Good job. All right. So now, uh, did you finish this one? Yeah. All right. Very good. I, I'm not. We're not gonna over. We're not gonna go, go over uh, this one, guys. Okay. No. You didn't finish it. Okay. Anyways, we have to move on. Okay. So, anyways, guys. So when we compare nouns, okay, they kind of work as you know comparing adjectives, right? Remember, guys, comparing adjectives, right, is like comparing beautiful, right? Beautiful, for example, you know. I don't know, uh, maybe, you know, uh, maybe, 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 maybe Dua Lipa is more beautiful than who, guys? Than who? Than Selena. Than Selena, right? <laughs> okay, Selena right. So all right, very good. Then Selena Quintanilla, right? Very good. All right, so maybe Dua Lipa is more beautiful. So he, 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 here, guys, okay, we're comparing an adjective, see? Okay, so this is an adjective. Now here, guys, we are not going to compare an adjective anymore. Take a look at this, guys. Let's, uh, can somebody please help me read the first example, guys? Go ahead. Let's read the first example. Anybody? Me. Let's go, Jose. Elora has more video games than George does. Very good. I have two questions for you. First of all, are we comparing? Yes or no? Are we comparing? Yes or no? Yes. Yes, guys, we're comparing. What are we comparing, guys? What is it that we're comparing? ¿Qué es lo que estamos comparando? Nouns. 
We are comparing, but okay, we're comparing video games, right? Video no. games. Video games. Is video game an adjective, guys? It's not, no. right? It's a no. noun. Very it's good. It's a noun. Okay. Very good. Very good. No. So, so between, all right, so between, guys, between this example, okay, right? So Edward, let's say Edward is more intelligent than George, okay? Now, let me ask you something, guys. Between this example, guys, the example of comparing an adjective, okay? Mm -hmm. Okay, in the example of comparing an adjective versus versus a noun, guys, what is, what other difference do you notice in the structure of the of the sentence? Uh, Edward has and exactly in the, the first. Uh -huh. Yes, sentence. here you can use other verbs. Okay, here you have to use the verb be. be. Got it. Here, guys, you cannot use the verb be. You cannot use it. Got it? Write it down, guys, okay? So when you compare nouns, guys, you cannot use the verb be. All right? But you can use other verbs. Okay? Very good. So now notice another thing, guys, okay? All right? Notice another thing. Video games. Is this something that you can count? Can you have one video game, two video games, three video games, four video games? Can, can you count them? Yes? Yes, guys, can you count video games? Puedes contar video, yes. video games? Yes, very good. Yes. yes. All right, very good. Uh -huh. So when you can count, when you have a countable noun, guys, okay? All right, first of all, this is a noun that is plural, okay? All right, video games is plural, guys. It's a noun that, that you can count, okay? If you have a noun that you can count, you can use more, all right? And if it is the opposite of more is fewer. What is it, guys? Fewer. Fewer, okay? You use fewer and not less because it is a countable noun, all right? It's a noun that you can count, okay? Why do we use, guys, fewer and not less? Because less is for not countable now. Exactly, I guys. Suppose. <laughs> yes, exactly, 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 guys, okay? Not countable plural nouns, okay? Okay, so, uh, so anyways, guys, so let's take a look at this, okay? Not not countable, non not non countable plural nouns, guys, just non countable, okay? All right. So I have fewer causes that you do, okay? So instead of more guys, we're gonna use fewer, all right? So now what is the noun that we're comparing here? We're comparing the noun. Cousins, okay? All right, let's let's go back, let's let's go back to the whiteboard, guys, so we can take a deeper look at this, okay? So so uh, let's talk about, you know, comparing, all right? We're gonna talk about comparing, comparing two things, all right? Now, when we compare two things, guys, this is what happens, okay? So use, uh, you use, well, a subject, right? Subject, okay. Now, you can use another verb here, guys, but just for the sake of making this simpler for you, okay, you can, let's use have or let's use has, okay? All right, and you can use other, other tenses as well, guys, okay? But you can use other verbs too, just optional, okay? All right, and then after this, we have, okay, after this, uh, she has, you can use more or you can use fewer. Now, these guys, okay, I'm gonna, I'm gonna place a note here. This is for countable nouns, okay? All right, and then you have to use a plural noun here, plus, then, plus, you know, um, plus a, a noun or a pronoun, guys, okay? Uh, 
guys, if you use, you can use an alias or you can use um, you can use a an object pronoun. Do you know what an object pronoun is? Me, him, her, them. Got it? Okay. So this, guys, okay, so this is the structure, all right? This is how you use it. Now, it's important to point out here that this right here is used, guys, okay? This right here, guys, is used with, right? This is for plural, uh, for uh, plural, countable nouns, okay? So far is it good, guys? All right, so what do we use, if, what do we use it with, guys? Everybody, what do we use it with? We use it with plural countable nouns, okay? Countable nouns. Very good. All right, so for example, right? Let's take, for instance, example, uh, let's switch the color, okay? So for example, guys, you can say, give me a subject, okay? I need it. someone to give me a subject, guys. Catherine, give me a subject, please. Um, Any subject. Um, I don't know. Hey, um, guys, what is a subject? Come on. A subject, Catherine. They cannot tell you, Coronada. A subject is anything, guys. Look, a second yes is a subject. Absolutely anything. Um, computer. A what? Computer, okay, right? Now, I need someone, okay? I need a person, okay? <laughs> but, but you can oh. say, let's use, let's use the computer, okay? All right, just, all right, that, that's actually a very good example. Let's use a computer, okay? So we'll say the computer. Thank you, Catherine. The computer. All right, the computer have or has, guys? Has. Has, right? The computer has. Very good. So that is the second part of the uh, structure, right? The computer has. Has. Has, right? Now, more or fewer, guys? What do you want, more or fewer? Stephanie, what do you want, more or fewer? Uh, more. Okay, has more, okay. Uh, now you need to give me a plural countable noun. Let's see, Nancy, give me a plural countable noun. Keys? You, you're muted, Nancy. You say, all right, Laura, let's give me one example, Laura. A plural countable now. Um, cables. More cables. Very good. Okay. Very good. What is next in the structure, guys? Then. Then. Okay. Then. Then what? Laptop. Then. Well, you cannot say then laptop. You have to use then huh. my or that laptop, right? Then my laptop. Good job, all right, very good. I was gonna say, you know, that computer has more viruses, right, than my cell phone, right? But anyways, uh, good example, Laura. Thank you very much, all right? Very good, so see you guys. We're no longer comparing adjectives, we're comparing nouns, okay? Um, do you want another example? Of course, right? Very good. Uh, let's go with, let's see, right? Now, uh, do me a favor, guys, everybody, Send me one example right now, okay? I'm gonna ask you, right? I'm gonna ask you guys for your examples right now, but I need everybody guys to send me one example comparing countable nouns, okay? Uh, Stephanie, right? Stephanie, give me your example, Stephanie. The movie. Okay, the movie. Uh, have, has. The movie has, very good. Has more. Uh -huh. 
let's use let's use fewer now fewer oh the movie the has fewer uh, as scenes as scenes doesn't exist it's just scenes oh scenes scenes yeah okay so the fewer scenes than the books than the books okay good job all right very good good job that was excellent thank you all right uh jacqueline jacqueline give me your example jacqueline everybody keep sending me your examples okay um sandra has more toys than my daddy okay i'm sorry what was your example Oh, it is Sandra's daughter has more toys than my daughter. Very good. Okay, so we'll go with Sandra's daughter has more toys than my daughter. Good job, right? I like that example. Okay. Uh, this is a great daughter. Okay, very good. Good job. That's a good example. All right, Ruben, Ruben, uh, could you please give me your example, Ruben? Yes. Okay, teacher. Go ahead. Okay. Uh... Guys, type in your examples in the chat, okay? All right, necesito, guys, todos los demás me tienen que estar enviando su ejemplo, guys, en el chat. Eso es lo que les pedí, right? Let's go. Okay. Okay, let's go. All right. Uh, okay. uh, yes, Ruben. Um, yes. Uh, yes. Give, give me your example, Ruben. Can you hear me? Okay, ahorita. No, no le enviado todavía. No, no. Give it to me here. Uh, okay. Say it. All right, meanwhile, guys, Laura says okay. the ants. Tengo que dar un ejemplo. Sí, yes, yes, Ruben, yes. Ok, ok, no, no la escuché porque ya perdí de conexión. Ok, bueno, that's good. Ahorita. Go ahead. Ah, el... The... The... Mm -hmm. My has... My what? Uh -huh, my house. You mean my house? Uh -huh, my house. Uh -huh. My house what? No, teacher is my house when we use the house. Why are you saying my house? Uh -huh, my, uh -huh, my house. What? That doesn't mean anything. My uh -huh, has three. Uh -huh, three. All right. Send me your example. Okay. I'm not really sure okay. what you're trying to say. Okay. All right. Uh, let's see, guys. Um, Nancy, give me your example, Nancy. Okay. The, the house uh -huh. has has more window than door. Then the house has more windows than door than the door okay very good all right very good guys very good okay all right now if you're saying if you're using the article of that guys you need to use the article well if you're gonna talk about something specific you need to use the article after then okay good. uh catherine give me your example catherine uh my alejandra alejandra has fewer friends than my brother has fewer friends than my brother okay very good all right good job guys good job guys okay good 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 i like that okay all right guys so far so good so far so good all right ruben did you get your example sir all right do my favorite guys the uh you should take a screenshot because I'm going to erase this, okay? Take a screenshot because I'm going to erase this, all right? Can I erase it now? 
Right, awesome. Okay, guys, so then we have, you know, comparing three or, okay. Now, hold on, before we, we move on here, guys, okay, there is something I need to tell you, all right? Now, we talked about comparing two things, right? Now, when we compare three or more things, guys, right, we're gonna talk about superlatives, okay? All right, however, these are not gonna become superlatives. Instead, guys, we're gonna talk about this, okay? Um, comparing, comparing non-countable nouns, okay? Now this one, guys, is like this. They follow, it follows, guys, the exact same structure than here, okay? Entonces sigue la misma estructura que esta, guys. La única diferencia is that instead of saying fewer, with non-countable nouns, guys, we're gonna use, what do you think? What do you think we're gonna use, guys? Okay, can you We're no, 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 okay? Much? So, you were gonna say, guys, okay, we're gonna say, hold on. No, it's not much, All right? So, subject, right, subject, plus, have, or has, right, or other verbs. Right, plus less guys, okay? This is this is the difference, okay? You're gonna use less. Plus non countable noun. Got it? So for example, guys, tell me a non countable noun, guys. Sugar. Sugar, okay. So again, so let's talk about Cheyenne, right? Cheyenne. Cheyenne what? Eating? Cheyenne's... Eat? I, no, guys. Cheyenne's follow the structure. See, I have to put them. Cheyenne what? Cheyenne? Guys, the structure. See, I have to put them. How? Uh, Cheyenne has, right? Has. Very good. Cheyenne has what? Less sugar than David. Got it? And that is the that is the only difference, okay? Mm -hmm. All right, so guys. Let me ask you this question. When are we going to use fewer and when are we going to use less? Less is for a uh, non countable and fewer is uh, countable. Countable, exactly, guys. Okay. All right, got it? Very good, guys. Okay. So write that down, guys. Okay. Write it down. Okay, escribalo, guys. Write it down, okay? Or, or take a screenshot, okay? Tome a screenshot también, right? Pretty good, guys. All right, now, guys. Um, all right, let's see, take a look at your examples. Uh, the how has, the, the Alejandro says, Alejandro has fewer friends than my brother. Very good. Uh, my garden, my gardenias, a variety of flowers. My garden has a variety of flowers. Okay, good job. All right, now guys, when you use superlatives, okay, this is another thing, okay? Let's talk about, not superlatives guys, but comparing three or more things, okay? Now this one is a little bit different. And this one guys, I needed to pay, guys, for this one guys, I really needed to pay attention because you're gonna get confused, okay? Right, aquí se me va a confundir guys si no prestan atención, okay? So, for this, guys, you're going to use subject, okay, plus again, have or has, plus, okay, the most, all right, the most plus 
the most or the same thing as before guys fewest okay the fewest the most or the few well, actually let's put it like this okay the fewest all right plus countable plural noun plus then well this is optional guys here this is going to be optional then will be optional okay and then you know you need uh either a noun this is optional too right noun or object pronoun okay jot it down guys okay jot this down real quick guys all right so for example think about um, all right so for example guys give me give me a subject guys let's see laura mauricio give me a subject laura um subject um, mario mario okay mario thank you mario all right jacqueline all right give me uh give me the rest of of the sentence please Mario mm, All right, Mario has what? Follow follow the rest of the the, the most Okay, so Mario has, right? The most the most what? Here is where Orange. people. Oranges. The most oranges. Very good. Okay. Okay. So you can say Mario has the most oranges. And that's it. Okay. Just leave it there. Okay. Now, here, guys, I'm sorry, right? Instead of that, guys, instead of that, erase this part right here. Okay. Instead of that, guys, you can say, well, actually, you can say whatever you want here, pretty much, you know. Mario has the most oranges. Of them all okay so you can say of them all okay the tall sayers right so scratch these guys okay scratch this all right so you can say right mario has the most oranges of them all or you can say just mario has the most oranges because we know that we're talking about all other things okay now here guys most all right people get confused guys because you're thinking about an adjective here, right? And this is not an adjective, guys, okay? This is saying, Mario tiene la mayoría de naranjas, right? Here, guys, the most means la mayoría, got it? All right? Now, because it is a countable plural noun, guys, let's 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 um, let's have an example with uh, fewers, okay? So who would like to give me an example with fewers, guys? Let's see. You can say Mario has the fewest uh, girlfriends. See? Got it? Es el que tiene menos novias. Got it? All right? But we use fewest, guys, because why do you think we use fewest, guys? Instead of less or, or, or the least, I'm sorry. Why do we use fewest, the fewest? Because of countable plural nouns, guys. Why do we use the fewest, guys? Guys, why do we use the fewest? Because I'm of the fewest. Because it's countable. Because it is countable in plural, right? Plural. You cannot use it with singular nouns. No se puede contar, no se puede usar con singular, guys, okay? Very good. Now, let's take a look at this other example, guys. If, guys, if it is uncountable, you're gonna say Mario has the least, okay? The least and, you know, something that you cannot count, right? The least uh, milk left, see, All right? But other than that, guys, or you can say, you know, the least, yeah, the least, the least milk, okay? Let's, let's use that, okay? All right, anyways, so, 
All right, so this is how you use, uh, you know, how you compare three or more things, okay? All right, so do me another, do me a favor, guys, send me another example. Piense por los ejemplos, right? Y envíenme todos, guys, un ejemplo usando the most and the fewest, okay? Let's go. The most and the fewest, guys. One and one. Todo el mundo, uno y uno, okay? Let's go. The most and the fewest. Do you have any questions so far, guys? Do you need help? Uh, I, ha I have a question. Is use just the the verb have or can be a, another verb? It can be another verb, yes. The only reason why we're using have or has is because I do not want you to overcomplicate your lives. All right, we're going okay. with step by steps. But yeah, you can say uh you can say for example Mario owns, right? Jose owns, right? La mayoría naranjas, right? Mario owns the most oranges, right? See? Mario, Mario ate, right? And lo puedes decir en pasado también, right? Mario ate the most oranges. So, so you can do that, guys, okay? But we're just keeping it simple right now, okay? But yes, Laura, good question. Good question. Very good. Thank you. Great. Very good. Any other question, guys? All right. Good job. All right, let's see, let's see, let's see, right? Let me take a look at your examples. I got a question. Yeah, yeah, go ahead. Uh, you compare you compare one subject uh, with all, all of them. Of them yes. all. Yes, uh -huh. of them all, yes, uh-huh. But I'm not comparing mm, one subject, man. I'm comparing the countable plural now, not the not the subject. You're comparing the countable plural now. You're comparing the oranges, remember? Now, when you say uh -huh. of them all, you're saying that todos ellos, okay? Uh huh. All of them all. Yeah, but I don't understand. Uh, what is a three or more thing? What is a three or more thing? Tres o más cosas. I don't know. Uh huh. Yes. So in this example, Mario is being compared. You know, um, basically Mario has the largest quantity of oranges of everybody else. Okay. So Mario being compared to everybody else, right? Um, is the one who has the most oranges, okay? Yes, yes, yes. So yes. you're comparing Mario, Mario, okay, so, so, so Mario I, I and everybody else. Exactly, so you have Mario, on, right? And then you have everybody the, else. Uh-huh. Yes, uh, got it? I, I, uh, I, the, Give an example when no no is a uh, everybody else. It's, it's not it's uh, not 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 is for no. for for think think. I'm not I'm not understanding. So if an you example mm -hmm. uh, which is a uh, for think. No, it's the same. It's, it's the no. same, right? Listen, Jose, Jose. Uh -huh. If you compare three, four, five, yeah, a million things, it's the same, right? It's the same. If you compare, you know, what, what you have one person to a million people, it's the same as one person to three people only. That's what I'm trying to say, okay? So, es la misma cosa, right? Puede que mm -hmm. en el ejemplo, I'm going to say it in Spanish, okay? Puede que en el ejemplo, guys, tengas a Mario y tengas a dos personas más. Lo único que está diciendo es que Mario tiene la mayoría de naranjas. De todos ellos. Of them all. Got it? Aquí puedes tener más un millón de personas. Right? And it's the same. Mario tiene la mayoría de naranjas. Of them all. Got it? It doesn't matter. Right? Now, if you want to be specific, and you don't want to say all, well, you can say all oh, them three, right? Cambia all mm -hmm. 
por el número 3. Yeah. All them four, ok? Cambia okay. all for el número 4. Got it? I, I, yes, yes. Uh, I can use this, this one when I talk uh, only uh, the student in English. What do you mean? Yes. I, I, don't, I don't get it. <laughs> this sample I can use for the only the this group student in English. Yeah, you it's more the, for this group. It's more the the two. When it's two people, you don't use this. When it's two people, you use the one that we we talked about before. Uh -huh. You sí, cannot yeah, use this, creo, this with two people. Creo que ya lo comprendí. O sea, es cuando, por ejemplo, en este grupo, en este grupo hay más de dos personas. Right. Yes. Entonces yo puedo hacer una comparación de 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 algo contra las demás personas que están. Exactly, exactly, exactly. Yes, ajá. you got it. Pero no son, ajá, no son solamente, no es como que estuviéramos dos personas. Eh, exactly. Tú y yo, o él y ella. Vea. Exactly. Ajá, ya, yeah, I got All right. it. Very thank good, you. very good. Okay, All right, thank you, man. Thanks to you. Okay, good question. All right, so let's take a look at your examples, guys. Uh, it says, uh, Sheldon, tell me. Tell me. Hey guys, necesito que todos me manden ese ejemplo, si no nos vamos. All right, let's go. Uh, yes, yes. Do you have a question? Teacher. Tell me, Ruben. Yes, Ruben. Ruben? All right, I don't know what happened to Ruben. Ruben? Ruben has a problem with you. Sí, ahorita le, ahorita le brindo mi ejemplo. Okay, go ahead, Ruben. Tell me. Eh, Mario has eh, five mangoes y my, y my friend Carlos has four co cocos. Mario, Mario has uh -huh. five ma mangoes. No, that would be the most mangoes. Like this, the most okay. mangoes. Right, very good, guys. Very good. Uh huh. And what else? Y su friend Carlos has the most four cocos. Okay, his friend Carlos has the most couples. Okay, like that. His most. Yes. His friend Carlos has the most couples. Good job, man. Good job. Good job. All right. Very good, guys. So uh, I have an exercise for you, right? So let's go ahead and practice, guys. I'm gonna check your exercise. I mean, I'm gonna check your examples, guys. But I do have an exercise that I need you to finish. Okay. So uh, I'm gonna send the screenshot right now, guys, so you can practice together. Hey, guys, how are you doing with the platform, by the way? ¿Cómo vamos con la plataforma? Good. Uh, Good. Finish. Did we finish uh, the midterm? Three. Uh, the three section. Section the one, movie. two, three, and the midterm. Three. Yes. Beautiful, beautiful guys. Okay. Good job. All right. Section one, two, and three, and the and the midterm. And uh, has everybody done the same, guys? Ya todo mundo hizo lo mismo. Yes. Yes. Beautiful, yes. beautiful. Good job, guys. Good job. All right, guys. So let's work together. Okay. I sent you the the exercises. So let's go.
Right. Do you understand the Do you understand the exercise, guys? No. No. You have to use. All right. You know what? I'm gonna send you the other slide, guys, so you understand. Okay. So you have to compare. Okay. okay? You have to compare. That's 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 what we're doing, right? Comparing nouns. Okay. So I'm gonna send you the other slide too, so you understand better what we're doing. Okay. All right. So there you have two exercises. Okay. Two air Two air so for, for example, right, I'm gonna help you with the first one. I'm gonna I'm gonna help you with the first one, and then you can you do the other ones, right? So, for example, okay. the first one says. Right. So the first one says. Right. It says at one point New York City had about 140 sky, wow. skyscrapers. Chicago had about Chicago had about 68. Houston had about 36. So Houston had the fewest. Got it? Okay. Now, do you understand the exercise now? Yes. Yes. I think. So, vas a poner si tienen la mayoría o la minoría o más que uno, right? So, just comparing, guys, okay? You're just going to use comparative. Vas a comparar dos cosas o más de tres cosas. Tres o más cosas, got it? Mm -hmm. All right. Very good. Mm -hmm. Right. Yes. Uh, More. Remember that in these exercises, More. you're gonna compare things, right? So you're either gonna uh, compare two nouns, or you're gonna compare three or more nouns. Got it? Okay. So that's what, yes. what the exercise is about. Okay. We're good. More. Number five. Four. More. Yes, it's uncountable. It's non countable. Non countable. Less. What do you think? The store has run from 500 to 1,000 rings. Serrano has 11 rings. Jupiter has four. Jupiter has uh, fewest. Yes, fewest. Jupiter has fewest rings. The fewest. You need to add the. Remember? The fewest. Uh, yes, the fewest. The fewest. Six. Mar has two moons. It has. It has fewest. Is purest. The fewest. <laughs> I fear your. See, fewer. Because just. There are just two planets. Yes. Fewer, right? Yes. 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 
by in the number teacher. three. Teacher. Is tell me, tell me. Act to person. When it's a non countable thing, how you, you write? You use the most less. or the least? The least or less if you use two things, right? Uh -huh. The most or the least? If it is three or more. Uh -huh. The more least. Yes. Yeah. Okay. If it is only two. Uh -huh things you know then that's either i mean that's uh less right okay. in the exercise the number two teacher is mm -hmm. Ash, 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 Rita, Furman, for many words records, such as jumping the longest distance on the pogo stick. On a pogo stick. In the pogo, ah, uh, on a pogo stick. In the fact, the whole, the more, he holds, the most. Ah, uh, the most, yes. Holds, the most, the most Guinness, yes. Uh -huh, the most mm -hmm. Guinness record of of any one, any person. one person. Okay. Pedro has the less medals than Enrique. What? No, that is two things. Uh huh. Sería. Ah, 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 ah. Okay. Then is a. Uh, Less, nada. Fewer, no. guys, Less. or more, right? I don't know. Fewer or more, right? Remember, it's medals is a countable noun. Puedes contar mm -hmm. medallas, right? Entonces, vos no decís less. This is fewer or this is more, right? Okay. Very good. The number four, Mandarin Chinese has about five, five, what, five. what? Five hundred million. I think I it's not mass. Maybe more. How are you doing, girls? Everything good? <laughs> Struggling. Uh, we are in number 10. Uh, I I say that I think it's more. The but one in, we are we are discussing. <laughs> All right. It has the way al the, the Hawaiian alphabet has 14 letters. It has more letters more? than which yeah, of course, 14 is more than 11. So yes. Mm, okay. okay. <laughs> right, very good. It's time to go back. All right. All right, guys. Hey, good job. Okay. Uh, well done, guys. Well done. All right. It seems that you got the hang of it. So, um, pretty good, guys. Guys, um, good news. Okay. I think let's select that one. <laughs> All right. So uh, <laughs> if you're into that, I don't watch soccer, guys, so it doesn't matter to me. But uh, <laughs> it might be good for you, okay? So, guys, uh, finish the midterm if you haven't. And uh, enjoy the rest of your week, guys, okay? 
uh if you didn't finish this exercise please finish it guys you know uh, today or tomorrow okay remember that the meter by the way needs to be completed before tomorrow all right so thanks a lot guys and i'll see you next week see you guys enjoy your weekend see ya okay good night good night